please subscribe and you can download this code from description below. When it comes to organizing your Python code, maintaining clarity and readability is crucial. One common question developers face is where to place obscure or less commonly used methods. In this tutorial, we'll explore best practices for code organization and discuss suitable locations for such methods. In Python, code organization plays a vital role in creating maintainable and scalable projects. Obscure methods, which are not frequently used or are specific to a particular module, should be placed thoughtfully to ensure code cleanliness and ease of maintenance. One of the fundamental principles in Python is the use of modules to organize code. Modules allow you to group related functionality together. Obscure methods that are specific to a certain aspect of your application can be placed within a module dedicated to that functionality. Consider creating helper modules or utility modules to house obscure methods that provide generic functionality but are not directly related to the primary purpose of the module. This keeps your primary modules focused on their main responsibilities. If your obscure methods are related to a specific class, consider placing them within the class definition. This provides a clear connection between the methods and the class they belong to. Let's illustrate these principles with a simple example. Assume you are working on a project that involves processing various types of data, and you have obscure methods related to data validation. In this example, data processor is the main class responsible for processing data. The common data validation logic is placed in the validate underscore data method. The obscure methods underscore validate underscore length and underscore validate underscore format are prefixed with an underscore to indicate that they are not intended for external use. Organizing Python code is essential for creating maintainable projects. By following best practices, such as using modules, creating helper modules, and using classes effectively, you can keep your code base clean and make it easier for other developers or future you, to understand and maintain the code. Remember to document your code, especially if obscure methods have specific use cases or considerations. Chat GPT